I'm Deputy Haglin with the Sheriff's Office. The reason I'm pulling you over is you have a license plate light out on this day. I do? Yeah, so it's not, there's no light illuminating your plate. So oh. I get to your driver's license, so registration, and insurance. Go ahead, Lil' Um, will you, in my, uh, not in my, right there, in the glove box. Oh. What am I getting? Should be my registration. Oh. Oh, wow. And do you by chance have an ID with you, sir? No, sir. Would you be willing to tell me who you are? No, I don't know, sir. I, I, there's no, you pulled her over, not me, so I just... Is this okay, it? I just like to know who I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, it's just my rights, too. I like to stick to them. Is this what I'm... Um, so that's registration. Last thing is, uh, that... And this is what insurance. you want, right? Yeah. Okay. Unless that one's expired, it might be expired. Well, it shouldn't be. If there it is, then there's another one in there. So the, the expiration issue. is on that right-hand side, about halfway down. Let me check to see if there's another So that expired in, Okay, uh, so there's right. another one in there, then. As they're looking through their stuff, looking for their stuff, I'm going to tell you some stuff. This video is all about the difference between a regular stop and a pretextual stop. A regular stop kind of works like this. A officer sees a man driving and he looks like he's speeding a little bit. So he goes ahead and he pulls him over. As the man opens the window, he smells an alcoholic beverage on his breath. So now it's turning into a DWI. Now that's a regular stop. How a pretextual stop works is like this. There's an officer sitting outside a bar watching as each person leaves the club before this man that he's following even makes any kind of traffic mistake he pulls him over he walks to the window and he says you went over the yellow line and i smell alcohol on your breath get out of that car and come do a field sobriety test that's a pretextual stop because he used the going over the yellow line as a reason to stop the man he considered probably drunk because he was leaving the club make sure you get out you want to see it yeah. Yeah, because I don't believe that shit. Do I even have a light bulb back there? You should. Yeah, and I legally don't have to provide. No, you don't. They still yeah, digging? They I'm like going to have to call my friend Chili De Castro. Pull down my trifold right here. Inside of it, I have my laminated identification with my registration. So I'm asking you to do the same thing for Should yourself. Uh, sorry. You want my tail light? Mm -hmm. License plate cover or license plate that's, light? That's the thing that they freaking pull anything and everything. Yeah. Even if it is, I don't even know what they have. Do you want this? Vape? Yeah. Vape pen? Tail light in there? Oh, you shut your skin off. It's good to act like that's my one. What does this guy need? Now, the real reason for the stop. So, don't. What's that? For what, sir? What? What am I doing? James, right? No, sir. No? What's your name then? It's not James. Okay, what's your name then? Uh, it's Jesse, but it's... Jesse. I'm not getting out of the vehicle, though. Okay, get tattoos on it. It's not. It's yeah. If you're thinking it's that it's... No, no, it's no, not. Sir, okay. I, if, if, no, sir. I wouldn't I lie to you. If my name was... So why would you just... If you, there's nothing wrong because with Because I'm, I'm exercising my right, sir. I don't have to. Okay. Well, it's awful suspicious. I stopped, when, I stopped right? by his yeah, house to suspicious. grab my dolly, but he's not. Suspicious. That's you, not. you still aren't with him? Suspicious not a crime. What? You've been, you've been in a relationship with James, right? No. You haven't been in no. the past? No. Yeah, it's our information, so. Why? Well, wherever you're you guys wrong. getting your information, it's wrong, sir. I've never been in a relationship with him. Okay. Do you have any invo involvements with him? 
I stopped by his house to grab my dolly because I'm moving. He left it outside for me. Yeah. But absolutely not. Yeah, I'm not I don't James. even think he's not no. even in town because that's what he so he left it out for me to go pick up. He wasn't there when I was just there. Until we confirm that you're not. That's fine. Mr. Lucky, then yeah, sitting here, okay? Yeah, sir. Yeah, I was like, what? Oh. Nobody else back here. No, no. sir. You no. Know. He still has my ID, don't he? Yeah. Yeah, I got a. I mean, can I see your left arm? Ow, shit. Alright. And then your right arm? I gotcha. Yeah, that's good. No, it's not. No, I ain't. That's your stuff, no? Yeah, no, no. I ain't. <laughs> but no, I got this tattoo, I got a leg tattoo, and a back tattoo. It would be a lot easier, man, if we could just see an ID. Yeah, but... Well, I'm not providing an ID. I'm not James. All right. He's really not. You want me to well, pull? You guys just hang tight while I get that stuff printed for you, okay? Okay. Yes, sir. Pull up his mugshot. That's where that video ended. Did you know the Supreme Court has approved pretextual stops? To me, they're just a way to get around the Fourth Amendment. During this whole encounter, Jason Rogers was trying to figure out the whole reason for this pretextual detainment. After all, he was just minding his own business when the cop came up behind him to ask for his ID. Or is this cop just plain old ignorant? Nothing, what's up? What, I'm wondering why you pulled me over. I had to send my hours over to my boss. Why, what's up? Who said anything about being pulled over? You I? just came up behind me, sir, and I tried to get out of my car and you just didn't respond to me. Yeah, I told you to stay in your car because it's not safe for you to stand out there. It's up to my discretion, sir. <laughs> so what's the problem? Listen, call? I'm coming over here to check on you to make sure you're okay. You don't have a flat tire or anything like that. Sir, I just sent my hours to my boss. All right. It's a conversation we're having, right? All right. All right, you got your license and stuff on you? You suspect me of committing a crime. You're in a motor vehicle on the highway. Do you suspect me of committing a crime? That's what I'm asking. You can't ask me for anything without, you know, suspecting a crime. Suspect the crime, sir. You're on the parkway driving a motor vehicle. I need to make sure that you have a valid license if you're operating a vehicle. I'm not talking about any crime. Sir, you can't just pull up uh, behind me. You can get your supervisor out of here, bro. Thank you. Supervisor for what? I just need your I'll ID. I'll take a supervisor, sir. No, I'm sorry. Yeah, we don't, don't do that. You have to call the station. There's no supervisors out here. No, sir, you just pulled up behind me for no reason. Yeah, to make sure you're okay. And now I I'm doubt that's what you did. I, what? I, I, I sur surely doubt that that's why you did that. I can't hear you, man. Hey, I, asked, I request a supervisor, sir. You, there's no request from a supervisor. You could contact the station. That's that's what we do for stuff like that. We, we have a... Uh, 20 minutes to conduct this stop, so I get on with it, brother. I'm not giving you my ID. I can call my lawyer. I can call my lawyer. You can speak to him. I'm not giving you something that you're going to use against me at all. I so, need your license to make sure that you're. You can't just driver. no. You can't just roll up on me and ask me for anything. That doesn't. That's not how this works, sir. Sorry, you are breaking your constitutional uh, value. Like, dude, call your supervisor. My buddy. constitutional what? What are you talking about? <laughs> sir, just call your call your call your supervisor, sir. Are you the registered owner of this car? Sir, I don't answer questions. Refusal? There's no refusal. No refusal at all. That's Listen, crazy. Man, I told you, I, I pulled up here to make sure you're all okay. Alright, you just if check you that I was to, okay. I'm fine. You, you don't, you know, you, you told me you pulled up here to make sure that I'm fine. Now you're asking me for a driver's license, sir. Because get, you're in get, a car. It doesn't matter. I can do whatever I want. I don't need to show you anything. You you used to suspect me of crime. No. Okay, then get your supervisor out here. Dude, you have only so many minutes. Just investigation over with. Listen, I'm not going to ask you again, all right? If you don't have your license on I you, have my license. I'll, I'll, I have my license. I'll, I need that from you, okay? You you give me the reason why. I told you. No, your no. your license is valid. I'll call my lawyer and you can speak to me. <laughs> Get your supervisor. If 
you don't have your license on you, you can give me your name, date of birth, and we can do it the long way. 111087, there you go, Jason Matthew Rogers, 111087. Can I get your name and badge number, please? Yeah, name's Trooper Moore and badge is 8479. Thank you, sir. Chevron all's over, bro. So, oh, um, when you're done with that stop, go to another one. Stand three miles. I'm like, ah. All right, so I'm going to give you a name. I just gave you to you. I, t I just literally what, told you. What's your name then? Jason Matthew Rogers. I, I love this. You came over here to check if I was all right, huh, sir? That's okay. And, and I, I can't wait till you get on. I cannot wait till you get on TikTok, bro. Hopefully you just you pulled over. Summit. You okay. pulled over here to check on me if I had a flat tire, bro. Get out of here. You're not. You're not protecting anyone. You're a tyrant. You just. You can't just come up and roll up. Hey, I want your license. No. Oh, look, here's my original station and everything right there. Oh. Okay, so next place for the car. I mean, my registration for the car? Sir, I, I have to check your license. You told me my license. No, you don't need anything. Like I said, you get your supervisor. Your Give me my ticket and I'll go. Tag's not coming back, so I'm I don't asking. care. Write me my ticket and I'll be on my way. This is not a criminal hey, offense. It's a citation. Give me my ticket so I can send it right back to your ass. The ISCS. I get out of here, bro. Believe it unless it happened, dude. You wouldn't believe it unless it happened. <laughs> Waiting for this guy to send me a ticket so I can just uh, give it right back to him. Okay, asking you, okay? What's your first name? I already told you that, sir. I've already told you twice. You failed to, you know, are you drunk or something? Why would you not? Listen, I'm going to ask you your name one more time. If you don't tell it to me, you're going to be put I told mess. you. For what? What's your first name? I told you what three times it? already, sir. Get me your supervisor. Just Jason like, Matthew Rogers. You can't just come up here and act like a tyrant. I don't know why you keep trying to tell me. Because you I just pulled up. Not allowed to do. I, I, I don't know why you think you can tell me what I need to say. I'm an American. I can say whatever I want. I have a freedom of speech. Dude. Jason, what's your middle initial? Dude, your supervisor. Get me him. Here. That driver had to stop his video just to call the supervisor. That's how ignorant that cop was. This is Corner News. And I put him on the same level as the Bluetooth eye. You're high beams, sir. Put him down. They're not high. They're not high. Put him down, please. They're not high. They're not high? Okay. You're not high? Alright. So you like to record? Hmm? Huh? So you like to record, sir? What was the stuff for? So you're high beams, sir. You need to take them down with this train. They're, they're not high. They're not high? No. May I see your driver license, sir? Well, what's the stuff for? For so your high beams, sir. They're not high. They're not high? I don't, I don't use high beams. Where are you coming from, sir? Doesn't matter where I'm coming from. <laughs> Alright. So where are you going right now, sir? It doesn't matter where I'm going. It doesn't matter where you're going? No. Mm -hmm. I don't questions. So you're just driving around? You're just uh, driving around? And that's a question. Why are you, gonna be, why are you having an answer, sir? Uh, I mean, mm -hmm. you're bothering my day right now. I'm bothering you driving? Alright. So you happy with yourself? I'm happy with my life, yes. Yeah. Yes. So you have a good day, a good night, okay? You try. I'll try. Okay. So who do you think is going to pull off first? It took a good long 10 minutes, but we all know it was the trooper that drove off first. We all had our money on four corners.
Thanks for coming in, everybody. And remember to click that notification bell so you never miss a live stream.